Medtronic is launching two brand new CGMs at the same time. I'm gonna break down the differences between each sensor and help you choose which one to order. But to start, why launch two sensors at the same time? The answer boils down to just having more options. The Simplera Sync right here was developed internally by Medtronic and basically took the exact same Sensate technology from the Guardian 4 and put it into a much more modern form factor an all-in-one transmitter and sensor, so nothing has to be snapped together or charged. The Instinct, on the other hand, is a special Medtronic exclusive version of the Freestyle Libre 3 Plus. Let's break down their differences and I'll explain why most, but not every person, should pick the Instinct. First, let's talk about size. So for comparison, this is the Guardian, this is the Simplera Sync, and this is the Instinct, and you can see this is the side profile. So clearly the smallest sensor is the Instinct. Just for reference, the Simplera is about the same size as the Freestyle Libre 2 Plus and a little bit bigger than the G7, but the Libre 3 and Instinct is the smallest of all. Here is an official Medtronic comparison table showing the sizes. It also shows that the wear time for the Instinct is quite a bit longer at 15 days versus the Simplera's six days plus one day grace period. Now the majority of people would prefer the longer wear period, but those of you with sensitive skin or struggles with making sensors last the full time might prefer the shorter wear period. And I low-key kind of like the whole six plus one day wear period for the Simplera because it actually allows people to receive one extra sensor per month, five instead of four. Next, you can see the warm-up period for Simplera is two hours as opposed to the Instinct's one, decisively in favor of Instinct. They both can be inserted very easily with one hand, which is a huge upgrade from the three hands you needed for the Guardian 4, and no overtape is required for either of them. Now, a few more differences not pictured in the marketing table. The Instinct has a lower MARD, which suggests it's more accurate, but unlike the Simplera Sync, the Instinct does not allow finger stick calibrations. Another small difference is the Simplera sensor is activated directly by the pump itself, whereas Instinct is activated through the Minimed app on a smartphone. So all in all, I think most people will be better served with the Instinct with its 15-day wear period, one-hour warm-up, smaller size, and lower MARD, but the Simplera Sync may be a good option for people with adhesive issues or people that really like the Guardian 4. For existing 780G users, you will need to update the software on your pump via mobile app, but after that, you can go back and forth between all three sensors, so I recommend you experiment and find which works best for you. I'd love to hear your thoughts and comments, especially as it gets in the hands of more people.